sunshine when he's gone It's not warm when he is away And ain't no sunshine when he's gone And he's always gone too long Every time he goes away yeah, yeah. I wonder this time where he's gone I wonder if it's going to stay But it ain't no sunshine when he's gone And this house just ain't no home Every time he goes away Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be getting it all done. Today is Monday. It's all full of fun stuff. And I hear little feet. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, pretty. <laughs> so like I was saying, today is Monday and we're going to be getting everything done for the week. I need to go grocery shopping. I need to clean up. I'm going to cook dinner and get ready and do something with myself and get out of my pajamas. What's for breakfast? <laughs> my mom took me to Costco and she got a whole bunch of waffles. So looks like we're having waffles for breakfast. I don't even wanna show you what's not in my fridge. I literally have to go grocery shopping. Oh my God. <laughs> She's so empty. <laughs> There's no food. <laughs> I know there's no food, but I'm going to give you waffles, waffles, <laughs> waffles, and maybe an apple, and maybe some yogurt. Let's do some yogurt with breakfast, too. I think I have a strawberry and one for Nathan, too. Let's cut this apple. I already pre rinsed it. If you guys are like, oh, wash your apples, I did. Uh, <laughs> okay. Slicey. Slicey. Slicey, slicey. I'm such a chef. <laughs> Yum. How is it? Delicious. Good. What are you eating? Can you? Not student. There's no need to show me. You can just tell me what you're eating. Apple. Apple. Thank you. Thanks, mom. You're welcome. So, um, I'm going to get ready because I'm in my pajamas and I have absolutely no energy right now well i mean i have energy it's just like i don't have energy to like get up and clean and do all this fun stuff that we have to get done today that i don't want to do but i feel that what helps me get out of my little funk here to get ready to get up and to do things is to get ready for the day so shower maybe brush your teeth put on a little bit of makeup maybe do your hair put on deodorant however you feel who knows so i already showered and i already feel 10 times better. I put lotion on, I put my face serums on. Oh, oh hello. Are you getting ready too? Yeah. Brushing your beautiful hair. Mm -hmm. Would you like me to put some detangler in it or something? I'll help you, okay? Okay. We can help activate your hair a little bit because it's so dry right now. Turn around. Okay. Turn around. Okay, hey, don't move, okay?
Um, I'm gonna pay some bills really quick and then we're gonna go to the grocery store because I have my grocery list. I'm going to put my meal plan on here, on my little whiteboard here. And I put like, you know, what we're gonna be eating for the week because everybody will always asks me, what's for dinner, what's for dinner? Let's go look at the board. ready to go into Sprouts. I tried to go to the bank, but like every bank that I was trying to go to was either closed or the line was ridiculously long. Kids are putting their masks on and we're going to try to hustle in here because it's hot outside. I need veggie stock, street tortilla, sourdough bread, chips, dates. Help me find dates. Excuse me. Help me find some dates. I just got home from trying to run errands. It was just a hot mess express girl. Like it was just a whole situation. I tried to go to the bank. I remember like the line was just too long and crazy. So I went to another bank location. They weren't having, um, their ATMs were working. They were down. So I'm like, okay, that's fine. So I just was like, you know what? I'm just gonna go to the grocery store, right? Went to the grocery store, took a little bit longer than I wanted it to just because obviously I had a lot of stuff to get, but then kids they love to distract me and talk to me about like just oh mom look an orange with a spot on it like just things like that just bothering me you know just not giving me a moment but they're kids that's what they do right yeah so i'm like give give me a moment because i'm i'm trying to get the grocery list down so i don't forget anything i went to go and get food at a drive through just because first of all it was already closing in on lunchtime and i wasn't in the mood to cook and the line for the drive through was ridiculous and there was nobody delegating the line to see who would go in front of who, who was next and things like that. It was such a mess and this older man cut, literally cut me off and was like, and I'm like, are you freaking kidding me? Like, first of all, I was next. I'll just genuinely say that first right now and I tried to wave him down like, hi, I'm next. There's two different lines and you, there's one going this way, one going this way and then you only go into one spot. This guy was in this line, I was in the straight ahead line, I was next, the car in front of him went, and then it was my turn to go. And he was like, no, I'm next. And he literally went and cut me up and went in front of me. I got irritated. I wanted to speak to the manager because I was like, you guys need somebody out here delegating the traffic because people are feeling super privileged and entitled that they don't have to wait in line like everybody else and cutting people off and things aren't being fair out here. The line is super long, everything is out of order. Like, it's just a whole mess. So. Anyways, after we did that, I decided to check out the bank again to see if the line had went down. It did not, it was actually worse than it was before. I swear, it's like time stood still at that bank and nobody moved anywhere. Finally, I'm pulling into my street and they block off the street. That's fine, so I had to go all the way around because they were doing some type of construction over there. So I finally go around, get into my gate, and I'm like, oh, thank God, I'm home. I'm pulling the groceries out of the car 
and I have paper bags because you know I'm trying to like reduce plastic or whatever and also their plastic bags are super like cheap so it rips anyways so I was like let me try the paper ones they seem stronger that's not true I was taking the groceries in from the car and in my brown bag it ripped and my groceries fell on the floor see my cauliflower running down the street my organic cauliflower running down the street I go and pick it up thank god nothing like glass or anything broke so I'm like walking in the house with all these groceries like trying to hold it so it doesn't fall anymore I get in the house and the kids tell me the water's turned off what at this point I'm just like you know what I don't even care anymore <laughs> at this point I'm just I've completely lost it water's turned off I need to call the management and see what's going on with that because how am I supposed to do my cleaning routine if there's no water how am I supposed to do that I don't know so my camera's about to die fun I need to charge that I'm gonna call the managers I'm gonna eat because I just need to replenish my body with something and then I will attempt to show a grocery haul and try to clean after they fix this water situation so pray for me in this middle but i i need a, i need a moment so what i can do right now is show you guys the groceries that i got i put them already in the fridge because i had to charge my camera and figure out like this whole water situation but um i'm gonna take you to the fridge and show you everything that we got okay fridge has so much more food in it and she's so much more happy than she was earlier so I'm gonna start up here so um, first things first I just got um, a thing of eggs here I take them out of the carton and I put them in like a container um, it's just easier for me to kind of grab and also it like saves a little bit more space I think um, and low-key it looks way cuter <laughs> And I got some coconut water back there. I've mentioned this coconut water like so many times on my channel. It's the um, Harmless Harvest organic coconut water. It's so good. And I got some um, fresh tangerine juice for the kids. Also some apple cider for the kids. This I already had. That I already had. And it's almost gone. Water. Okay. So now we're going to move on to the next shelf. I have... Um, two things of uh, vegetables here. This is baby kale. I'll put that in smoothies and I have some baby spinach that I will also put in smoothies Here I have some Italian parsley and I have some rainbow chard here and some um, green onions that I'm gonna be using and I wasn't able to like rinse or wash any of my fruits and vegetables because obviously there's no water but typically I would put this in a little um like mason jar with water so it like kind of stays lively so I can use it throughout the week but um, everything else is just gonna have to I guess chill for now but back there I have the cauliflower that was rolling down the street good thing she was all covered up in plastic and then what else did I buy oh I got some halibut here that's gonna be for dinner tonight so I got these white corn tortillas here we're gonna do fish tacos for taco Tuesday I also got some minor sourdough bread I always get this bread it's so good like the best vegan bread ever moving on down here I have two things of blueberries and some organic strawberries also some um, pineapples here I'm gonna put them in smoothies and then I have some grapes I have to clean all of this except this this is already fine but I need to clean these and these and these when the water turns back on so i'll keep it there for now i also got some yogurt tons of yogurts um i got the stonyfield um little yogurt tubes for the kids and i put them in this little container for them to kind of just grab and go for snacks and i got noosa yogurt we love noosa in here for snacks or breakfast it's so good and then back here this is my chobani yogurt that i've already had but that Chobani Greek yogurt right there is for smoothies. So I got one of those. And then in here, we have more vegetables and stuff. Got three avocados, cucumber, and a zucchini is somewhere down there. Zucchini, three for dinner too. And I got two things of these um, organic Caesar salad kits and three um, russet potatoes. I got some raw milk white cheddar. I always get this cheese whenever I can, super yum. I also got the kids some Horizons Organic Chocolate Milk. Here in the freezer 
it's just mostly more fish. All of this stuff I already had except for I got some Beyond Sausage. And these I already had. Oh, and I had some wild um, sockeye salmon here. I got a big thing of that, so. Yep, if you don't know, we're a pescatarian family, so um, we have all this stuff. But I mean, I feed the kids like chicken nuggets and stuff. Sometimes, just depends, but for the most part, we do um, a pescatarian diet. Okay, so in the pantry, let's see what I got in here. So I got these um, um, Harvest Snaps um, pea chips. Uh, Nadi really likes these. We got the Caesar flavor. Um, I love Late July. Their chips are so good, so I'm super excited to try their cheddar cheese crackers. And also got two things of chips. I have veggie chips and veggie straws. And I think that's all that I got so far. Oh no, there's something over here. I got some um, medjool dates here. That's going to be for smoothies. I also got some um, plantain chips here for snack time. Those are a little spicy, so they're probably just going to be for me, but that's fine. It's super good. Hello, 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 hello. So what I decided to do is organize my uh, bathroom and clear off the countertop and then I could like spray it down with some um, all-purpose spray at least yeah, I don't really need water for that and then um, yeah then we'll see what happens I don't know I'm just gonna organize what I can great news. While I was trying to go to the bathroom, I took a leap of faith and I flushed the toilet. I said, please God, if you hear me, please let the water be running. And I took a, I took a chance and I flushed the toilet and then guess what? It flushed. <laughs> and the water works.
so this is our menu for this week, only for dinners. Um, the only thing I did was I actually switched Monday and Thursday because while I was unpacking the groceries and putting them away, I ended up um, wanting to use the fresh halibut that I actually got first for tonight's dinner. So basically just switch Monday and Thursday and that is our dinner menu for this week. So now that that's all done, I wanted to clean my floors next. That's kind of like what I've been kind of procrastinating on. Um, so I'll do that right now. And then pretty much everything is not that bad, really, to be honest with you, but the floors need some tender loving care. This is what I'm going to be using to clean my floors. I'm going to steam mop them. Um, this is the Bissell Spin Wave, and it has like dual spinners, I guess, and you put like the cloth rags on the bottom and it sprays out the solution and then it cleans the floors as you go so this is really cool um, i really do like it so i am going to fill this bad boy up and get ready to clean finished cleaning the floors and about to cook dinner now and you guys are gonna come with me we're gonna cook together and I'm going to be making that halibut dish that I showed you guys earlier and that is actually going to be a dish in my cookbook here clean slate well, it's not my cookbook but it's one of my cookbooks that I have bought but um, yeah so we're gonna be making the dish out of that book and it's super good I made it before it's super light and healthy and filling and um, it actually calls for cod fish but um, I'm not really interested in cod right now. I want halibut, and that's what I got, so that's what we're gonna make.